Feel free to choose whichever size pixel you prefer because you'll get the same great experience on both. We don't set aside better features for the larger device. Both devices... <laughs> We're also making it easier than ever to switch to Pixel. Most new Pixel users will be able to transfer their stuff from their old phone in less than 10 minutes, including all of your photos, apps, and even your iMessages. So we're happy to announce that Pixel 2 users will continue to get free unlimited storage for all of the photos and videos they capture in the highest resolution, including 4K videos and motion photos. This is a big deal. This is a big deal. Pixel users take twice as many photos as typical iPhone users and store an average of 23 gigabytes of photos and videos per year in Google's cloud. If you had to use iCloud, you'd reach your free limit in less than three months. Pixel 2 comes in three colors, kind of blue, just black, and clearly white. <laughs> we, we love picking the color names. So with Pixel, you'll never run out of space for your mouth. And you can say goodbye to those painful storage full pop-ups. And there's a subtle wedge from the top to bottom, and there's no unsightly camera bump. Pixel is available in three colors, descriptively named, quite black, very silver, and a limited edition, really blue. Turn your sound on. Change is good. I do it all the time with my makeup, my outfits, and even the angle we're shooting in right now. Change is what life is all about. Trying something new and fresh like the new Pixel. There's just a few things you got to do to make that change super smooth. Let's get you prepped. So first things first, make sure you're getting messages from your friends and family on your new Pixel. So before you take out your SIM card on your old iPhone, you want to turn off iMessages and FaceTime. So here we are in the settings menu. We're going to go right here into messages and you're just going to turn that little button off. Let's do FaceTime. Same thing in your settings, go to FaceTime, boom, turn it off and you're good to go. Okay, so do you have a work phone or maybe you have a work account set up on your phone? If you do, you probably have encrypted backups and you want to take that off. So we're going to turn off that work profile right there. Boom, it's gone. <laughs> so if you guys have any problems, be sure to reach out to your IT person for help. Next, you want to grab your computer. You want to connect your old phone. Boom. And this part is really important. In iTunes, make sure your backup is not encrypted. All of your important stuff will transfer neatly to your new phone when the time comes. That's going to take a few minutes. Let me go ahead and show you guys some fall outfits.
turn your sound on. What's up? Gotta get cute for you guys, really. That's more like it. What's up, everybody? It's Todrick coming to you to show you how to get your old stuff onto your new, fierce Google Pixel. Got an old iPhone? <laughs> you should talk to my friend Whaley. She's got some amazing tips on how to get your phone set up. If you got a notification to finish set up on your new phone, you've come to the right place, and I'm gonna walk you through it. First, make sure that you've popped your SIM card into your new Pixel or that you're on Wi-Fi. Make sure that both phones are at least 50% charged. Yes? Yes! <laughs> We're good. Next, take your old phone's charging cable and your quick switch adapter that came with your Pixel and use it to connect your phones together. Once you've connected your phones, just follow the instructions on your Pixel screen. All right, let's get personal. Sign into your existing Google account using an email or phone number. If you don't already have a Google account, where have you been? Great, we're logged in. Everything you synced is now on your new Pixel. And for everything else, Pixel's gonna scan your old device so you can bring everything over. Then you could choose what you want. All right, hit copy and let Pixel work it. This is gonna take a few minutes, so I'm gonna take this time to work on a few dance moves. <laughs> if you have any other accounts you'd like to set up on your Pixel, add them later in settings under users and accounts once you're all set up. Six, seven, eight. Connect your phones and log in and transfer. And more accounts, that's what this video is all about, yeah. And if you happen to need a little more help, there are literally people waiting to help you, like, right now. No, like, literally, like, right now. So check out Andrew's video on how to get more help.